In this video, I want to talk about picking a category. Uh, now, for some of you, this might be very, very simple. Uh, there's not really going to be a whole lot to it, but I just did want to stress um, kind of what's going to happen here when you pick a category. So I'm going to hit edit on the category selection here. And you can see that this company is actually not only just an electrician, but they also do plumbing work, HVAC, and heating. Now, this is really where it starts to become important. If you were, for example, like a pizza place, you know, here they can give you some good examples so you wouldn't type in pizza and pasta or pet food and toys. There's actually very specific categories that need to be picked. Um, basically, you want to find a very, very specific category that describes what you do for a business. It's not like keywords. Here they give you another example. So if you're a wedding photographer, that's all you're going to put in. Um, you're not going to put in things like photos for events or photos for weddings and all these other things like doing different keywords. You're just going to do one category and that's all you can do here. Now what's going to happen, another thing I just really want to stress, and this is a great example. So let's say you're a similar company to this. If, um, if you're just one category, then you really don't have to worry about this. But if you do find that your business is really servicing multiple categories, just like this one here, um, the primary category that you pick is going to basically give you more relevant results in search. So if I actually had them set up as a primary uh, business for an HVAC contractor, then there's a lot higher chances that if I go on Google and type in HVAC near Windsor, Colorado, that they're actually going to show up higher. Despite being in here, um, I believe just from what I've seen, just doing a lot of searches and um, being kind of in this uh, industry, I guess, for a little while, I've seen that Google is overall giving more relevancy to the primary business category. So this company, really, they decided that, you know, the electric part of what they do being, you know, electricians, things like that, that is the biggest part of their business. And I have other companies that also do electrical work, and they decided to do HVAC. I have other company, companies that have also decided to just pick plumber because maybe that's all they do. So this is really the very important that you want to pick um, the primary category because that is going to be the most relevant for what people are looking for. It's going to help you show up higher in search. And then on top of that, you can add the secondary categories. You can just add another category, and you're basically going to be able to add in any of those. You're also going to see as you type, so let's just say they did air conditioning. We could add an air conditioning contractor or air conditioning repair, air duct cleaning. Um, you really get a whole bunch of uh, other categories you might be able to pick. And these, this type of company might also offer some of these things. So that might be good to actually like go over with them. Uh, you know, in my case, obviously, this is one of my clients uh, going over this and, you know, basically adding other categories because they're going to have more relevance here and show up higher for searches based around these types of things. So I hope this makes sense. If you have any questions, feel free to let me know.